What's up guys, today we're going to be talking about the four most important logo elements. When contemplating the logo creation, several fundamental elements must harmonize to create the distinctive style. Certain logos may employ specific elements exclusively, while others blend them comprehensively. Number one, color selection. The process of choosing colors for your logo goes beyond your personal preferences. It's a task that demands research and careful consideration. To begin with, comprehending the psychology of colors is crucial, as it helps you grasp that impact on your brand's perception and enables you to convey your brand's essence to your audience effectively. The appropriate color scheme in a logo can either enhance or detract from its effectiveness, significantly influencing the emotions and associations linked to your brand. Now, while it may be tempting to explore the wide array of colors, a general guideline is to limit your logo to no more than three distinctive shades. Because basically, overloading your logo with so many colors can be confusing and um, overwhelming. Number two, images. The use of imagery in your logo can represent an opportunity to convey your message effectively, as a single picture can speak volumes. Graphics within logos can range from straightforward to intricate, ornamental to functional, and can stand alone or integrated with text. Ideally, these images should reflect the product itself or evoke a certain experimental quality associated with your brand. However, some logos use abstract visuals to express creativity and personify their brand. When opting for conventional or out-of-the-box imagery, it's advisable to establish a connection between these visuals and a story or emotion relevant to your product. And it's also important to keep in mind that any image used in a logo must be scalable and adaptable, ensuring it can be resized or formatted for various branding materials while at the same time remaining recognizable. Let's take Spotify for instance. Its logo serves as a compelling illustration of an abstract image that effectively encapsulates the essence of the brand. This music streaming service uses a green minimalist green circle as a backdrop filled with green horizontal lines as their logo. These lines are skillfully crafted to resemble the sound waves, imparting a touch of personality and human connection to the brand. The graphic itself is abstract, but the story behind makes sense visually and conceptually. Number three is actually my favorite one, typography. In a nutshell, typography encompasses the choice of your font style, appearance. Letters can be manipulated in various ways, aligned differently stacked, rotated, or creatively positioned to craft the compelling logo design. Logos primarily composed of text are often referred to as logotypes, letter marks, or monograms. Now the fourth component of a logo is a tagline. It usually sits under or around a logo and is a simple sentence or a collection of words, usually between two to seven words. Um, that captures the heart or the spirit of the brand. This can be helpful to articulate what your business does or what it represents. And to be honest, not all logos require taglines, but it can leave an everlasting impression, helps in conveying your brand's message, foster your brand's awareness and resonate with your audience. Now take Nike for example, it has a tagline that says, just do it. And somehow it's motivating, encouraging, to people who use it, basically the audience. Now crazy enough, some people might fall in love with the brand just because of that tagline. Now that's how much powerful a tagline can be in your brand. So that means you have to invest so much time actually in um, finding the perfect one that actually suits your audience. Having said that, that is that guys and I hope you found this video helpful and if you did, please hit the like button and leave the comments down below if you have any questions or anything uh definitely see you in the next one peace